In the last 10 years, uh, a lot of corporate governance changes were triggered by scandals. And so there has been a big shift actually in emphasis in the boardrooms, more towards compliance as opposed to overseeing the business or contributing to the strategy. So boards are just getting to realize this and are moving more in the direction of uh, paying attention to the business side of uh, the equation. Boards certainly have a responsibility to approve a strategy. The question then is what kind of role do you have before you approve it in terms of formulating the strategy. I think at the end of the day the most important thing boards need to learn how to do is ask questions because they need to be inquisitive, they need to be knowledgeable enough to know what are the right questions to ask. There's a limited amount of time uh, in the boardroom and they don't know all the answers and in fact it would be a bad idea for a board to be normative or prescriptive in terms of answers because the management presumably actually has the knowledge. But by asking the right questions, I think the board will be both prompting the management to search for the right answers but also challenge the management to think deeply about the answers that they're giving. The best way for a board to deal with activism is before it happens actually. If you are continuously engaged with your shareholder base, you communicate what you are trying to do, you get their input through a variety of mechanisms, both with the help of the management, then you will be in touch with your shareholder base. And so when an activist shows up, you can test whether in fact they're in line with the rest of your shareholder base or not, but also they will have your back in case there's a fight between you and the activists. There is a reason why the institution of a board is created the way it is, which means that you want to have 10 diverse people, but working in harmony. It, it's almost like uh, being in a symphonic orchestra or something like that. You know, each piece has to contribute its, its thing, but at the end of the day, there is only one music. So that's the balance. You, know, you need a diverse board, but a diverse board what, that works together as a team.